Hi, this is Imogen Lamport from Bespoke Image and Inside Out Style Blog. Today I'm going to be talking to you a little bit about um, under eye bag concealing. Now a lot of us tend to get dark shadows around our eyes and it can be from anything from an allergy. Um, sometimes you might find that if you've you've got a lot of hay fever, you're allergic to things, you might actually find that taking an antihistamine before you go to bed or half an antihistamine will actually get rid of your under eye bags and puffs. Otherwise uh, it can be, you know, a really big bad ones can be signs of kidney problems. So if you have very bad dark circles, it could be worth going to your doctor and, you know, getting checked out. But if it's just like the rest of us, which is a bit of life and tiredness, um, and you can't do too much, good sleep is always going to help. But still, sometimes we get the dark circles still. So how do I get rid of them? So what happens is as we get older, our eyes tend to, as we kind of lose fat and stuff on our face, our eyes tend to sink a little bit further back into our head. And as our, you know, wrinkles come and our forehead drips, it actually makes our eyes kind of sink back a little bit and disappear. So especially as we get older, it's really important. What we want to do is draw the eye forward. So to do this, we want to use a concealer and get rid of the dark shadows because the dark shadows, remember that dark recedes, light advances. So I want to make my eyes pop out. I want to get rid of those dark shadows. So I might want to use a concealer. Now I've got a little concealer carousel here and I've got um, the green, which is good for covering ruddiness. So if you're a bit red and ruddy, that's great to put on before you put foundation on. I've got the purple, which is good for sallowness. So if you're kind of particularly sallow, do that. Um, and then there's a range of, there's a kind of slightly yellowy one and a slightly orangey one and then a dark one. So depending on your skin tone and type and what you're concealing, different colors, different uses. But today, because my dark circles are slightly purple, I'm gonna use the slightly yellow one. Now I've just put a little bit of foundation on um, and I tend to conceal after foundation rather than before unless I'm using a mineral powder. If I'm using a powder, what I'll do is I'll put the, the concealer on first, then I'll put the powder on. But if I'm using a liquid foundation, go for foundation first, then conceal. Because sometimes you might find there's nothing left to conceal. So, I like to use a brush, because I find that a brush is a much more effective way. My finger is much bigger than the brush, and so I can get really, you know, better into the corners and things. So what I want to do is make where it is dark, light. And so we tend to get shadow all the way from up here and all the way down. Uh, so think about there. A lot of people just do this bit here and they leave this bit in here. And in fact, this bit here is really important to, uh, to put your concealer on. So what I'm gonna do is take a little bit of concealer. Really don't need much, not much at all. It's much better to layer up than it is to put on too much, harder to get rid of. I'm just gonna have to look at myself in a little mirror so I can see what I'm doing. Um, and now I like to go right in to the corner. and just on where it is dark. There's no point on going where it's light already, but just where it's a little bit dark. And then I'm just pushing it in with my finger, just kind of stipple dabbing motion, rather than, I'm not pulling blending, I'm just dabbing, 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 because that just uh, gets it to sit in more naturally. So what you can see now is that this eye doesn't have the same obvious dark circles as this side does. So now I'll just do a little bit on this side. You can see that it's, you know, it's just blending away the dark shadows. And this is going to make me look more alive, more awake, and all the sorts of things that I want to look. I don't want people to think I'm sleeping through my life. So that's a little bit about using a concealer for around your eyes to get rid of dark shadows. Thanks. Bye.